All right, for those of you who are gonna ask how we got the pumpkins down there, because they're huge and heavy. Yeah. Now we go get them. Gotta go in that way. All right, guys. So we're up above us. Doing a gift drop. Dropping off the pumpkins. Look at this. Look at this here. This little snap here. You might say, all right, it's not high up, right? But look at this here. Look at how hard that thing is bent. That's not natural. Like, it didn't just grow that way. That thing didn't snap and tuck under there, but look at this. See how, see how much pressure was put on it to do it? But it didn't break it. I wanted to keep it alive. Look, it's a connection. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna mess with this spot because I come and I kick this stuff around. It's here for a reason. Look at this, huh? Look at this, look at this vine in a big ass circle. Holy shit, somebody's over there. That's weird, that is, that is weird. It threw me off because the guy's in a black hoodie. Shit, I almost walked right back through it. That is some weird shit, man. He's not all the way in. He's not all the way in, he's up by the, he's up by the edge. It ain't gonna affect what we do though. Oh, he left. All right, he left. He went up the. He might have just been looking at a deer, something like that. Look at this golf ball in the jar. I'm just really not used to seeing people in here. This is not usually a trail through here. This is nice. Like this is this trail ain't usually here. This is a new one. It's not usually as easy to get to this point. See, there's the bird. There's the bird feeder. I think I left. Oh. I think I left some stuff here. I was with Brian, but I can't remember what it was at this point. Well, we gotta stay on the task at hand, which is trying to find the pumpkins uh, so I can gift them in the right spot. one This one got caught up on this tree. Didn't make it all the way down. <laughs> They're actually in a fairly decent spot, to be honest. I might, I'm just gonna put them on that rock, I think. So, hey, bear with me, I'm gonna have to pause it so I could do this. Okay, my friends, so there they are. We're gonna get this one to, we're gonna get these to kind of sit better. They're really heavy. 
so they ain't gonna budge. Like they ain't going nowhere. If, if they move, if any of those move, it's cause something moved them. That's, that's it. Look at that, huh? Look at the view we have up to the pine forest. It's just like when we got that awesome video. What a hell of a day that was. It's one thing to see it. It's another thing to experience it, like, and video it. Somebody might be up there, hanging out. Got a message a little while ago from a friend. <clears throat> He's uh, up in the Catskills as well. Yo, something's moving up there. Something just moved up there. All right. Well, um, it looked like it took a couple of steps out from maybe behind one tree and then got behind another. Um, if it was somebody like, nobody goes up there, but if there was, like, it, they would probably just be walking, right? Um, yeah, so he, he messaged me and. You know, I won't get into the full details, but he had an experience. And, uh, Bigfoot experience. And, uh, that almost makes me happier than when I have one on my own. It really does. Like, it just, it's, it's, it's another person making contact with Sasquatch. And I know how special that is. I really, really do. And especially in the beginning, like, it's so exciting. And I love that I'm, like, the person that people can come to. Like, that makes it all worth it. It really, really does. I remember the first people I reached out to, and I remember how they all reacted. I remember how they act reacted as individuals, and uh, how they treated me, and what they did with my situation. It looks like there's a straight cut through now, through there, which has always been impossible to get through too. So. It looks like they're opening some things and closing others, which is which is normal. It's just completely different this year. Look at that. So this is where they hang out. Obviously, this is this little man cave right here. Da 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 da. Pine forest up there. Bang bang boom. Bring it back. There's your pumpkins. So they're not too far off. I just launched them off the top of that hill. It's the only way to get them, like, that's the only way to get multiples in here. That's it. I, I, one year I brought in a wagon. I had a, I had a whole bunch of them. I brought in a wagon. But, uh, obviously I had to gift them off trail. So, the, the little Red Rider wagon thing didn't uh, didn't go that extreme, so it got me so far, but anyway. This is about the exact spot we were at when we filmed them that one time, going through. Pretty sure this is right about where I was standing. A very fond memory. I know I talk about it quite a bit, but it's a very, very fond memory, obviously.
and one that we can share, which is even cooler. treetops yeah, we had a pretty bad storm yesterday very very nasty weather high winds and uh, a lot of rain it's enjoyable I mean to an extent but Well, it looks like that guy in, with the tent, um, or whatever we thought it was, it looks like it was just a bunch of BS. Look at that. The thing blew over yesterday, and nobody seems to give a damn. So I'm assuming that it blew over yesterday in the wind. And, uh, was that a decoy the whole time, you think? Keep me out of this area? Because it worked to an extent. I was doing it out of respect for who I thought was in there. But ultimately, were they trying to... Is someone trying to keep me from being in here? Or did somebody actually stay there and their tent just blew over? But if someone was sleeping there... Hmm. Oh, I'd be interested in your input. Got a lot to do today, guys. I'm not going to stay long, but I wanted you guys to be part of that process. I'm going to hang out for a few, uh, try and bring in my brother, see if he wants to hang out for a minute. And uh, that's it, guys. I'll go from there. I'll see you on the next one. But as um, I apologize that it's short, but you know, I'd rather do a short one than nothing. So. As always, my friends, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you next time. If anything wonderful happens, I will cut the camera back on up. Something's telling me to go over to this spot. So while I'm in transit, I'm just going to video. has changed over here, huh? It has gotten so wide open with the leaves falling off the trees. It's gonna be a good time. Loader. It's broke. That one snapped. I think this is his little hangout right here.